Hey guys, it's uh, General Heat here, and uh, today I'll be sh uh, revisiting uh, how to board a scarab on Halo Reach. So what we want to do is uh, get to this point near the beginning on the mission, uh, the Pillar of Autumn. We need to do with two people. Um, we need to turn on the tilt and cowbell skulls for this. Uh, so what we do is drive here onto this cliff here, one person on the back with a rocket launcher. The road won't get to the edge, just have the person shoot the rocket launcher and launch you guys onto the scarab. So let's watch that in slow motion. So, right about here, have the person turn around and aim right at the ground, right behind you. And then fire it. And then the explosion, thanks to the cowbell skull, will launch you onto the scarab. And then the, uh, the tilt skull keeps you from being blown up. So you can survive uh, getting onto the scarab. Now once on the scarab, uh, you're free to uh, explore around. Uh, this is actually the uh, original Halo 3 Scarab. They just pretty much copied it into Halo Reach. Uh, everything about it is the exact same. Uh, you can even destroy the Scarab. Uh, partially destroy it. Um, you can destroy this back part and then you know, it just leaves like a giant hole in the back. And if you shoot it, uh, the Hunter Blood, the orange Hunter Blood comes out. Uh, just like it does in, on a Halo 3. Um, the turrets on the side are fake. Uh, you can't really get on them. So eventually the scarab will hit the barrier and you'll get pushed off of it and back onto the ground. Um, there is a way to use the scarab to get out of the map and actually do a time travel glitch, but that's another glitch we'll revisit later. This is just a really quick glitch we wanted to show you again for our next revisit. So, you know, we got some really big ones coming up soon, so make sure you subscribe and stay tuned uh, to check those out. And remember to drop a like if you enjoyed this, and we will see you next time.